Hi, today's exercise is going to be both a combination of cardio and abs. I'll run through some of the exercises with you first and then we'll put it together as a routine. Cardio moves include knee highs. Knee highs, hands in the air, and just bounce those legs up as high as you can. Get the arms actioning as well so that you're getting your cardio burn. For those who find that a little easy, we do it and turn it into the river dance and we go. Star jumps, you've all done star jumps. They're basically a nice jumping jack or star jumps. Modified version, not so explosive. But you can still do this super fast. Get that move, get those arms up. A mountain climber, I like to have my arms either side of the mat, shoulders over the wrist, nice long body, and then we're just going to bounce our legs in. Modified version, go step it in, not run it in. Modified version, go to your knees, drag your leg out to the side. All are working your core, all are good. I love this one, it's called the gridiron shuffle. All we're doing is tapping our toes as fast as we can, nice and wide, and then if you want to, we go, hot one, hot. So every time you clap your hands, you do a squat, down you go. Or just stay bouncing side to side. I have exercises to try. One is called the V-sit. It's as simple as create a bunch of V's, hands on your knees, hold that, and then let go. To advance that, you might tap your heels. Maybe push your legs out. Another advancement is to just hold up. So we've got a nice V, namaste hold, V-sit. Another one is the Russian twist. If you've got a dumbbell, grab the dumbbell, pop back into your V position and then just rotate side to side. Key thing, keep your shoulders all the way around and your head facing this dumbbell as you turn side to side. The leg extension, we're gonna go on our back. Our legs are up. 90 degrees, you might want to put your hand under your bottom to protect your back, head down and then all you have to do is drop the legs. Variations, maybe keep the legs bent if it's too much pressure on your back. Really easy version, keep the legs really bent by your bottom. So there's level one, level two, Level three, level four, two legs, level five, hands above the head, level six, all the way back. A plank. Always best to start the plank right down low. Elbows under your shoulders, tuck your toes in, up onto your knees, up onto your legs, and now you have a plank. If you want to do it on your knees, that's okay, flat back. Do it on your toes, just hold that position, breathe through it. Again, there are modifications to make it harder, but this is fine. 